death battle, you never ceased to disappoint me. You did, um, you did great on the uh, Aang versus Edward fight, and then you decide to give us this. Are you fucking serious right now? Now, before I talk about this fight, there, there will be spoilers. So if you don't want to be spoiled by the actual fight, then don't watch it, because. You know, there I will be spoiling the fight, alright? I won't be bringing the research, but I will be bringing up the actual fight itself and what the uh, outcome. Okay, if you don't want to be spoiled, then don't watch this video. Anyway, let's get started. So, Ghost Rider vs. Lobo. What can I say about this fight? This is another atrocious death battle. Now, it's not because of Lobo winning. Lobo didn't win. Ghost Rider won this fight, and... I should be happy that Ghost Rider won because I'm a huge Ghost Rider fan. Hell, a lot of us should be happy since a lot of us are Ghost Rider fans, including a YouTuber named Ann Kabotaku. But if you watched his predictions video about this fight, then you'll know that it's he says he's, it might be another 2D sprite animated battle and Ghost Rider is going to win. And Ancap, if you're watching, you are absolutely right. Ghost Rider was gonna. Ghost Rider won. Ghost Rider won the fight, and I'll be honest, I am not satisfied. No, no, not satisfied, but I am not surprised that Ghost Rider won, since it was obvious. Death Battle made Ghost Rider win an obvious thing, and that's one thing. That's one thing I don't don't like, making it obvious. Anyway. <clears throat> This fight was atrocious. Atrocious, mostly due to the fact of the 2D sprite animation. Really, it's it's that bad. Like, how can you make a, a 2D sprite animation look terrible? Seriously, how can you make it look atrocious? The funny, the, the ironic thing is, Death Battle actually has the, the resources to make a 3D fight. A CGI 3D type of fight. I mean, they've done it before. For example, Dante vs. Bayonetta, Saw Snake vs. Sam Fisher, Raid Raiden vs. Wolverine, and even the Dino Megazord vs. Voltron. They did 3D fights before. Decided to be lazy asses and give us another 2D sprite animated fight. Now, the sprite animated 2D sprite animated fights can work if they're done correctly done good sprite 2d sprite animated fights before they've done it so many times it's become repetitive the animated fights repetitive and it's just you're fun and i shouldn't say fun but it's no longer exciting it's just boring and this is exactly what this fight is boring it's just pathetic death battle has the resources to make a 3d fight but they decided to be lazy and give us another 2d sprite animated fight and it's not even, like I said, it's not exciting. You don't get invested in this. And like I said, a lot of Ghost Rider fans, like me and Ann Kapotaku, we sh were excited for this. Yeah, we were excited. We get this. Boring, badly, poorly animated, unsatisfying fight with an obvious winner. In Ghost Rider. It's not satisfying. It's not exciting, it's not even, it's not, you don't get invested in this. It's not like Aang vs. Edward that was actually a fun fight, even if it was 2D sprite animated. This is the 2D sprite animated fight done bad. It's just, come, it's just, why? Why have a 2D sprite, why have it as a 2D sprite animated fight? Okay, that rhymed. But anyway, just why have a 2D? Why not have a 3D? Again, like I said twice, Death Battle, you guys have the resources to make a 3D fight. And you give us this. I'm just... I am lost for words about this whole thing. I really have no words to describe how fucking frustrated I am. And please excuse me for my language, I'm just frustrated right now. Because I expected an awesome fight. It wasn't awesome, it was boring. It was unsatisfying. 
and it was unsurprising when Ghost Rider won. And I know a lot of people are going to hate me for this, and probably they're going to be asking, or actually no, I'm just going to say it right now. This fight does not come out until tomorrow, but thanks to Anka Pataku, I was able to watch it today because, you know, fuck you, death battle. But anyway, this is just a tro another atrocious death battle. It was boring. The animation was terrible. It was not satisfying. And it had an obvious winner. It was just terrible. I just... I have no words for this. I have absolutely no words to describe this. I'm done. I'm done here. So in conclusion, this is another atrocious death battle, like I said. And it's just a battle that I would not watch ever again. But yeah, that's that's it. That's all I'm gonna say about this. So And I know Ankabotaku is going to I, I know Ankabotaku when he reviews death battles, he gives them a rating like a number out of ten. Out of it's good, bad, or okay. But this is just atrocious, so for the numbering score I would give them I would give this fight I would give it a 2 out of 10 for having terrible animation, being boring, being unsatisfying, and just overall having an obvious winner. But yeah, I I'm done here. This death battle is just terrible and honestly, death battle needs to get their shit together or even more people are going to stop watching them. But that's pretty much it. I'm done here. See you guys later.